guys, what's up? So today I wanted to talk to you all about my Japanese hair straightening. I have talked about this before, I think I filmed like a post Japanese hair straightening video and I know a lot of you guys had questions about the whole process. So I'm going to talk to you about the process and then about how it is now because I just actually recently got it done. So what the Japanese hair straightening is, is it basically just is a whole process to straighten your hair and make it permanently straight with chemicals. So the chemicals basically just change the bonds in your hair and make them straighter. So what happens is they will first wash your hair, um, make sure there's like no product in it. And then they will apply this kind of serum, which basically is changing the bonds in your hair. Then they will leave that in your hair for a little bit, and then wash it out, blow dry your hair, and then ch take little, little chunks and straighten it. And I know the specific guy who straightens my hair, he goes very close to the baby hairs and gets those straight. So then they'll put a solution that will basically just seal everything that they had just done and then we'll wash out your hair and then blow dry your hair and you are left with perfectly silky straight hair. Now this, I've washed my hair plenty of times after getting this treatment done this past time, um, but what I can tell you overall, this process and this whole treatment is so worth it. It is so life-changing. I'm like not even over exaggerating. Naturally, my hair is very, very wavy. It is not... I don't want to say curly because it's not tight curls, but it's very tight waves. But they're not curls because my hairstylist told me this last time that it's not curly, it's just very wavy. Hair will grow out from the roots and then I know for me for this last time it grew out up to here, like the natural hair grew back up to here. And then basically the ends stay straight forever. Unless, I guess, the only way would be if you just never got it done again and it grew out all the way. So that is the entire process. I personally would recommend this for anybody who really just wants perfectly straight hair but doesn't have the time to go over it with a flat iron every single day. And honestly, I barely use my flat iron ever now. And I'm going to be so honest with you, I washed my hair two days ago, so I'm about to go wash it tonight. Um... And I let it air dry for probably 45 minutes, almost an hour. And then I just blow dried it a little bit because this back chunk is a little thick. So I had to go over it with a blow dryer. And this was the result. It was super shiny and it's obviously super straight. And I kind of loved the first couple months because your hair still hasn't grown out that much. But after a full year, I mean, my hair grew pretty fast for over a year, and it grew out up to here, like this much of my natural hair. So this process was rather pricey. I did pay quite a bit of money for it, and then you have to tip, and then there is a specific shampoo and conditioner that go along with it. I usually never believed anything that I heard about, like, oh, you have to follow through with it. I just really thought that... It was the company just trying to make more money in the salon, just trying to make more money. But it makes a world of a difference, you guys. Like, I'm not even joking you. It's just, it's crazy how soft the conditioner makes your hair and how clean your hair gets with the shampoo. But it's also still helping it stay straight and as well as with the conditioner. And with both, a little bit goes a long way. But for my long, thick-haired girls, you know that you use a lot of conditioner. But I'm going to be so honest. I will insert the name of the shampoo and the conditioner's brand right here. And this is the brand that I use. Um, basically, the only place you can purchase it is at the salon or Amazon. But I'm like a little weary of Amazon and eBay and everything like that. Just like buying products in general online. Even Kylie Cosmetics, I'm going to be honest. Like just buying products online is a little iffy for me. Um, clothes are one thing, but when it comes to like hair and makeup and stuff, I am very cautious of that. I hope this video was helpful. Comment down below if you guys have any other questions that I didn't answer in this video. And let me know if you have tried a Brazilian blowout or a Japanese hair straightening. Comment down below if you have just absolutely any questions. I'll be happy to answer them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you guys later.